Hey, it's CRB, man. Look, I'm going to go ahead and tell you what it is. I got a problem with a lot of these YouTubers out here. All right? I got a problem with all you out here. I got a problem with Trucker Brown, Lil Sean. I got a, oh, I definitely got a problem with Scooby-Doo. Scooby-Doo! I got a problem with you, man. Ike, Mark, that crazy guy, Trucker Tree, Trucker T, KD, Sinister, Diva. I got a problem with all y'all. Little guy, little dog. Uh, every All 10,000 people, YouTubers over at Prime. Got a problem with all y'all. Tell you what the problem is. Turn the truck off. I want to I wanna make sure y'all hear me when I say that. I'm going to take the glasses off. Tell you what my problem is. My problem is I ain't got a problem. All right, look. I just saw a Scooby-Doo video. I ain't watched Trucker Brown live feed, but uh, <clears throat> let me tell y'all something. If at any time that there's a YouTuber, okay, that's commenting on your videos uh, with a negative comment, trolling, or whatever, first thing you need to do is click on that person's profile picture. Because you got a couple people out here that will take an individual's picture. And it happened to me. Somebody was going around as the right brother and trolling all the other YouTube truckers out there. Right? I just so happened, I don't really pay attention to the comments too often on other people's pages. I just so happened to pay attention to this one particular person comment. Uh, comments. Uh, what, what Dread? Yeah, I got a problem with you too, Dread Pirate trucking i got a problem with you too um and i just happened to look at the comments and saw that it said the right brother and it was just talking some bs if at any time you get any youtuber out here you see they pictures if it's party hard key to weed if it's um if it's uh smitty if it's uh anybody that do youtube and they're on the page commenting which, believe it or not, a lot of YouTubers, we don't really comment on other people's page. We don't even really hit like. We watch the video. We might mention the video in a video. But we're too busy doing whatever we're doing to uh, just go down and leave. Sometimes we'll leave a comment like thanks or nice or something like that. But uh, let me tell you something. Look, 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 look. Look at that. What? Don't be looking at me like that. Then what are you looking at? Looking at me like that. Go look at me like he checking somebody. I ain't in the mood for it. I am not in the mood for it. Click on the profile, please. All right. Uh, like I said, I was watching a video with Scooby Doo, and I guess <coughs> somebody's going around with Scooby Doo's picture. Uh, it is bright, even though it's overcast. Somebody's going around with Scooby Doo's picture. I guess write negative comments in the and what Dread Pirate called the dirt pit, the comment section. And I guess Trucker Brown must have made a live feed about it. I just jumped on YouTube um, probably about 20 minutes ago going through my feed, so I haven't seen what, what Trucker Brown said. But if any time there's a negative comment from somebody who's a YouTuber, click on the profile. Make sure it goes to that particular person's profile. Meaning, if you click on, if there's somebody going around that's the right brother, you click on my profile, you should see um, 17,000 subscribers, yeah, Trucker Brown. Um, you should see um, 600 some videos. You should see a, a playlist of my videos. You should see my bios and all that other stuff. You can click on the about. You'll see that, oh, it, especially the about. If you click on the about, and if the page was made a week ago, a month ago, if the page was made less than two years ago, then it's not, it's not that particular person commenting, all right? <clears throat> We kind of need to, um, I just watched Ike Stevens thing and he was talking about the YouTubers peace. Like we have peace out here. I mean, Casanova came on and throw a monkey wrench in, in the whole program, but you know, shit happens. But other than that, yeah, ain't, ain't nobody beefing because everybody's doing their own thing. As far as I see, again, I'm OTRB. I'm always the last one to know about anything that's going on. But um, definitely check the profile. Don't take the comment from another, if it's especially if it's a YouTuber, especially if a YouTuber, because there's people out there that wanna. How did uh, how did BS say it? That wanna draw a feeling. What did how did he how do you put it? There's people that wanna get a reaction from you. 
I'm just put it like that. And if they can't get a reaction from you, they're going to use somebody like me, Chuck Brown, Lo Shine, <clears throat> even Casanova, Party Hard. Dude was using Party Hard's, uh, uh, I think he said his grandma or something like that. Somebody who was really close to him. They was going around using her picture on their Facebook profile. You know? So be wary. You get negative comments from somebody who has a cartoon picture. Okay. You know. Shout out to Paul S. I ain't seen him in a while. I think he's trolling a lot of other people. Uh, not even trolling. He, well, yeah, trolling. I don't know what you want to call it. Uh, they're using a cartoon picture or if their picture come up with just a, an initial or, you know, then yeah, okay. But if you see somebody picture out here that's another YouTuber and they're commenting on your platform, whether you're live or not, click on the picture. All right. If you pay attention to some of these YouTubers, everybody has a cadence in how they talk. Right. I have a cadence. Trucker Brown has a cadence. Uh, what's her girl name? P. May has a cadence. Miss Diva has a cadence. Trucker Tree has a cadence. Um... You know, a lot, a lot of people have cadence. So if you if you see a comment and you like, that don't even sound like that person, it's probably not that person. So Scooby-Doo, I've never had a problem with Scooby-Doo. Scooby he does not need to stop YouTube because, you know, you got all these young guys out here. We all doing our own thing. We need we, we need the OGs to come on out here. <coughs> and I'm pretty sure you know what an OG is. And I don't mean it as a gangster. I'm just meaning as a... An older individual who's a little bit more wiser that we can um, gain glean information from. All right. Uh, so Scooby Doo, uh, I have an idea of if you were to comment, how your comment would, would would come across, and there's nothing wrong with that. So wh whomever is out there using YouTubers' profile pictures to create drama and different things like that, which is a mess. Um, I need to go check Trucker, Li Trucker Brown live feed because I hope he didn't buy into it. Uh, but for Scooby Doo to make a video, I'm assuming he did. Nobody has a problem with Scooby Doo. Scooby Doo's the man. He does his thing. Uh, CDL family, shout out to y'all. And um, so, yeah. And even the situation where people thought that me, Chase and Andrews, and Scooby Doo had a problem, it wasn't a problem. He put out some information. Uh,. I saw the I saw Chase and Andrew's video, and then next to my time feed was his video, and I needed to verify for myself as being a YouTuber who does the things that he said that you should not do. I went and verified it. Now it was somebody else in the video that 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 said whatever whatever negative term, you know somebody somebody shitting you or something like that. But I don't have a problem with Scooby Doo. There's no reason for me to have a problem with Scooby Doo. Technically, I have a pro <laughs> I personally. I need to put that up. I personally don't have. I, there's one person that I that I wanted to have a problem with. Shout out to Brad. I wanted I wanted to be like, oh, I don't like this dude. He, you know, he hating on me and this, 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 and that. You know, and but I don't have a problem with the dude. <laughs> um, so I don't have a problem with nobody out there in YouTube land. I tend to do my own thing and move my own direction. So Scooby-Doo, I don't think you have anything to worry about. Do not stop doing videos. If you want to, you know, not do them as much as whatever, but you know, you're like a level head and you're, you're, you're like, you're like level, level, you know, like calm waters in this, in this, uh, in the sea of just, I don't know. I had a metaphor of mine, but it's bright. I'm sorry. I don't understand why snow is so bright. Anyway. Oh, oh, that's better. Um, but anyway, man, so definitely take a look at that, okay? If there's somebody out there making comments using somebody's profile picture, because I think, you know, now that I made this video and put it out, somebody probably even used my picture. Click on the profile. If the profile, if you click on the profile and it goes nowhere, person made the, the account two months ago, it's not me, all right? And like every other YouTuber that's out here, there's no YouTuber that's afraid to say another YouTuber's name if they have a problem with said YouTuber. And that's the part that, uh, oh, that's the part that um, we need to understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me show y'all real quick. I went from sunny California, and this is what I'm dealing with now, in seven hours. You wonder why I'm coughing, and I always seem to be under the weather. That's why. Um, just be mindful, okay? 
when the dude was going around using my name, he made comments on Ghost, and Ghost told me, if you don't know who Ghost is, still hogging TV. He's a YouTuber. Uh, definitely check him out. He's over in Jamaica right now with his fancy ass. Simba! Hey, young, young Simba, let me tell you something, girl. Look, look, you're going to be successful. And if at Allen time you need me to come and uh, address anybody, you let OTRB know. I got your back, baby. I got your back. All right, but <clears throat> I know this video is probably all over the place, but the moral, is, the moral of this video is do not get caught up in the comments. All right? You know? And for the YouTubers out there, Kitty Wee, um, do not take what the, the people in the comments say serious. If you let what people say in the comments affect you, you're going to have a problem. You know what I'm saying? You're going to have a problem. People wonder why. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll respond to, to all the comments once a month, maybe. Once a month is usually when I go in there and get, and get to all the comments. You know, and... um. But don't listen to what uh, people say in the comments, especially if it's negative or derogatory. Or you got to understand how to pick out con constructive criticism from. Well, I want to say catharsis. Well, I don't even know if that's a word. <laughs> from the BS. Damn, that was. Listen, I'm not taking a shot at beast mode. All right. You know, you just gotta you gotta weed out the BS. It's like I said, I you gotta weed out the beast move. You know, <laughs> you know. Shout out the beast move cousin. Um, but don't take it serious, okay? You're making a video to put out some information. Um, are you entertaining? Yes. You know, do you have charisma? Sure. Do you have this? Yes. Do you have that? Yes. But there's always gonna be somebody negative in the comments. Uh, it just get a little weird and a little disrespectful when they go around using your picture to invoke, invoke a reaction. So definitely check on that. You know, if you see a comment from me, TV, any anybody that's on YouTube that's a YouTuber, click on that and see where it goes. All right, you can do it from your smartphone. Go get out of this way. Go to this way. Click their picture and see what you get. All right. It's, T it's TRB, baby. Uh, I'm about to go pick up this load, go home to my muffin mess. I ain't been home in about three weeks, which is odd. I'm usually home every weekend or every other weekend. And um, I got something at home that's called Mecca, M-A-C-A. -A. All I'm saying is I think the kids might be a little sick. Even if they ain't sick, you know, you want to protect your kids, right? So you want to give them NyQuil just to make sure that they don't get sick when they go to sleep that night. <laughs> yeah. Take this green stuff. Uh, you know. And then when my kids get older, I'm wondering why they drug addicts and pop and molly. Hey, listen, ain't that at fault. You know, ain't that at fault. I just want to protect you from being sick by giving you some NyQuil, you know. The adult version. <laughs> Would I do my kids like that? No comment. I'm going to say no on, on here. Um, what else I wanted to cover real quick? Um, also, when you're doing your live feed, for whatever reason, you get a lot of Russians, just like this Russian bomb, and they're all saying all kind of crazy stuff in Russian, uh, which is weird. Um, I don't know what that's about. Uh, I don't know. If somebody pay somebody to say, hey, come over here and, you know, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Um, I'm sorry there, Big Pete. Waiting on my load, that last star driver. Um, so don't worry about that stuff, okay? Don't worry about it. Um, what else? To the trolls out there, I mean, hey, you do what you do, man. You do what you do. Um, what else? Scooby Doo, I addressed I address that. He, you all right, man? You all right? Uh, who else? I think that's about it, people. <coughs> I lost my train of thought. I think this cow is Illuminati with that tattoo on his leg. What you look? You keep looking at me like that. I want to walk over there too, but I got flip flops on. And that's not happening. Listen, everybody have a great weekend. All right. 
I just made me a nice little 15, huh? Company. <laughs> but I had to be out here three weeks to get it and I had to run my ass off on them paper logs. That is not the business. But I, <clears throat> I'm paying. To get on at the company that I'm trying to get to, I gotta pay off about, I have 12,000 in debt. Um, 9,000 of it is student loans when I went to Jackson State University for college. The rest of it is medical bills back, you know, when I have valid fever or whatever. Um, so once I pay off about $2,000 in debt, um, I'm gonna reapply for the company that I want to go to because you gotta be under $10,000 to get on. And a lot of people think I'm going over there with, with Loshan and Trucker Brown. I'm not. You wanna know where I'm going? I'm going to Swift. <laughs> and even if I ain't going with Swift, I'm gonna tell y'all I'm going with Swift. Uh, somebody called me and in, in the conversation, they was like, where, where are you going? I was like, I'm not telling you. And she asked me, well, why you gotta be like that? Um, once people find out where you're working, not, not the people that genuinely enjoy your content, um, and I want to give a shout out to everybody that I've met out there at the few islands and different things like that. You could have easily went on Facebook and everything and exposed what company I'm with and let everybody else start calling. Look at the baby cow kick you in the butt. Um, so I really do appreciate that y'all did not do that. <coughs> um, I'm going to post that on Facebook too. I really do appreciate because, you know, if I meet you in a few islands, that, that's the company. A lot of people ask me, do you own that truck or are you leasing that truck? Uh, and I tell them, no, this is the company I'm with that I found off Craigslist or whatnot. But um, uh, I just want to thank y'all. I lost my train of thought again. Holy smoke. I'm hungry. I want to thank y'all again for uh, for not putting, putting the company out there. But oh, the reason why you don't want to tell where you're going is because if you are going to be doing YouTube, there's a lot of, there's a lot of things that come along with, with that, such as people using your photos and trolling other youtubers uh they also call your company on you and anything you do or say is it, they they can call the company on you and and you don't really want the company eyes on you like that you know <clears throat> so no i will not tell where i'm going if you meet me out there in the field guess what this is where i'm at you know let's keep that between us you know what i'm saying i understand some people i meet ain't gonna keep it between us I ain't gonna I ain't gonna say who I think those people are, but <laughs> no, nah, but that's the reason why I'm not telling where I'm going. Just just think like right now, this company that I'm with, only a few people know where it's what company I'm with. So I'm able to just do what I want. It's freeing, you know? I'm still giving y'all content, giving y'all entertainment, information, interacting on the live feeds and different things like that. Oh, dude said because I made that that video about super chat and about donating to YouTubers that I was begging for money, you know. But you scouring for content, you motherfuckers. <laughs> <clears throat> ain't nobody begging. For, we ain't gotta beg for money. But all I was saying, it would be nice if you did support somebody, you know, if you like their content. Um, shout out to everybody that showed me love in the comments. Uh, in about a week or two, I definitely will be getting back to, to most of the comments. Uh, it's just I get so many at one time. And I know that's late. Like, you know, you need the information right now. And I'm, I'm waiting two, three weeks to get back to you. I understand. I understand. But if you caught my live feed yesterday, I'll tell you what happened. The drive up here is about seven hours, right? I was supposed to be asleep, but I was doing a live feed. And this is what I mean when I say truck drivers are busy. Instead of being back to sleep, I did a live feed for like an hour and 20 minutes, right? By the time I got off the live feed, I did paperwork. After I got done with paperwork, I was emailing because I had to email this company and that company about <coughs> different paperwork and um, my time my time's in and so on and so forth. By the time I got back into the bunk, I only caught like a 20 minute nap, you know, because and they were, cause they was already in there loading the trailer up. About 20 minutes, it came knocked on my door. I pulled out, ready to go. I was dog tired, but if I would have caught that little hour, um, all in total, it was about three hours. If I would have caught that little three hour nap, you know, I would have been fine. And I could have ran up here. I could have been up here tonight. Last night, as soon as they opened, I could have got unloaded. I could have been already back in California right now. 
And when I get back to California, guess where I'm going? On home time. So instead of me getting on home time around 2 in the afternoon, 3 in the afternoon on Friday, I'm not going to get down there to home time until uh, sometime tonight, 7, 8, 9 o'clock at night. Because I was tired. I have to pull over and take a nap as windy as it was in California. And then, even though I'm telling y'all this story, a lot of people are going to be like, so? You chose to do a live feed. I did. But when I say, you know, people are busy, this is what I mean. This is what I mean. You got to use your time properly. You know, you got to do what feels best to you. And if, you know, and I want to do a live feed. I haven't uploaded a video in a while. Wanted to get to a Q&A with you guys, answer whatever questions y'all have. And, um, and now, you know, I'm behind schedule. I wasn't late for the load. I'm on time for the load. The load instead of instead of the load being um delivered at twelve at twelve thirty, it could have been delivered at seven a.m. I could have been probably crossing over. I could have been in prim right now and taking a shower. So when I get home, I can just <laughs> yeah go holler at muffin mints ASAP. Bathroom, dough, lock it. Let's get it popping. You know, lock it. Let's get it popping. You know, but yeah, what else? What else? I want to speak on. Shout out to Chase and Andrews, man. Shout out to Dean, baby. How many of y'all out there at 22 years old had over 60,000 in business credit? Not in debt, not student loans, not out here trying to ball and all that. 60,000 in business credit, baby. You know what I'm saying? How many of y'all doing that? Huh? I don't know, not many of y'all doing that. You know. I gotta go pick up my next load. Gotta be there at 2. It's 12.51. Pull up and get out their way. But, um, listen, I want everybody to have a have a great weekend. Alright? If you're religious, God bless. If you ain't religious, be happy. You know? If you're spiritual, make sure your calm was correct. <laughs> yeah, dude. What other randomness I want to get out the way? Uh, what else? I think that's about it. I think that's about it. I just want to come on here and uh, speak my piece on Scooby Doo. I'm gonna run over there and check out Trucker Brown's live feed. And uh. see what he was talking about you know what I'm saying y'all be careful with trucker y'all know trucker brown's a, 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 a short fuse man what y'all doing but motherfuckers like that though I ain't gonna lie shit be entertaining I ain't gonna lie I don't like real housewives of Atlanta but I like when trucker brown snap off on somebody for legitimate reasons <laughs> alright man look it's TRB as always thank you for stopping by, baby. Give yourself a hand. Alright? I'm gonna wiggle waggle my way on to wherever. I'm gonna wiggle waggle my way on to wherever. Wiggle waggle my way on to wherever. Wiggle waggle my way on to wherever. Well, I feel like that was a that was a rap lyric right there. You know, that's mumble rap. I'll holler at y'all. Peace.